Hi everybody, so today I'm going to be reading a book called Whose Boat Is This Bo Boat by Donald Trump. Comments that don't help in a, the aftermath of a hurricane. Before I start, don't forget to click the subscribe button, notification bell right beside it, so that you'll be the first to know when I'll be posting a new video. And also, don't forget to like this video. Let's start with the hilarious book of Donald Trump. Whose Boat Is This Boat? by Donald Trump. By accident. When natural disasters happen, presidents respond in different ways. Some presidents wonder how they can help. Some presidents wonder how to make sure it never happens again. Some presidents wonder whose boat that is. A hurricane is happening and a plane is flying away from the White House, the President's house. And that's probably the President, I don't know. Yeah, but that was the president coming, and all of the villagers are just staring at him because his face looks weird. <laughs> Is this your boat, or or did it become your boat? That boat is wiped out. Or not. I got mistaken. Some of them are news reporters. Wouldn't want to cross the ocean with it. And do you know whose boat that is? They don't know whose boat that is. To see what we're seeing, this boat, I don't know what happened, but this boat just came here. Look at his imagination. The boat is just literally coming to the shore. Also, uh, what kind of president would be thinking about whose boat it is while there's there happened like a ginormous hurricane? Out of the deal. At least you got a nice boat out of the deal. Have a good time. <laughs> he paid sausages to buy the boat. And they still didn't figure out whose boat that is. The end. There's no moral. This book was assembled by the staff of the Late Show with the Steph Stephen Colbert. Whatever. After Hurricane Florence hit, Donald Trump spotted a boat that had washed ashore. It was then he unintentionally wrote Whose Boat Is That Boat, the first children's book that demonstrates what not to say after a natural disaster. It's an excellent teaching tool for readers of all ages who enjoy learning about empathy by progress of elimination. Have a good time, everyone. Bye. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Bye.